YouTube. What's going on? Woody P coming back with another one. Let's get it. You know I got to keep the fire coming. You know I'm outside. Going for a little walk. Don't care if it's winter time. You still got to exercise. Move your body. But yeah, we're going to talk about how Andrew Tate took over the internet in one year. Yeah, Andrew Tate, my guy. Andrew Tate, he's always uplifting man. Trying to bring true masculinity back. And he just stand on everything that he talks about or that he says. So yeah, how Andrew Tate took over the internet in one year. You know, I gotta keep the fire coming. So before I start the video, please watch the entire video. And if you like, subscribe to the channel to receive more content like this, just content about life and various topics. Let's get it. Yeah, Andrew Tate, big social media influencer, big content creator, so big. He's been banned from majority of social media platforms. But Andrew Tate took over the internet in 2022. How did Andrew Tate take over the internet? One of the first content creators and first social media influencers to just be straight up raw with it. Straight up raw, don't sugarcoat anything. Come with the facts, facts over feelings. And he stand on everything that he talked about or that he says. Talk about cars, he got it. Bugatti, all the cars, he got it. Talk about the women, he had a flock of women. He has a flock of women. No content creator or social media influencer had done this. Everybody talk a good game. Everybody can talk a good game. Very few can back it up. Andrew Tate was one of the guys that could back it up. People hate that. When you can talk your shit and you can back it up, people hate that. They do, because most people are just full of air. Just talk shit. But yeah, not only did Andrew Tate uplift men, he has programs to help men. Hustler University, things like that. Programs to actually help men, standing on his word. Not just talking out here. You look at 2022. They won't put this out there because, you know, he's been bad. He's going through some issues with the, with the law right now. But he was a top five search name in Google in 2022. Now, if that's not influence, I don't know what it what is. And he's a smart guy, too. He knows what he's talking about. So you couldn't play him. All you could do is talk shit. He work out. He put in the work. So all you could really do is talk shit. That's all you could do. He stand on everything he talk about. Piers Morgan bring him on this show just for views because he know the influence Andrew Tate has. People, content creators, you just throw his name in the title, you getting views, views, views. If that's not influence, I don't know what is. Come on. I'm talking. He coming raw with it. Saying what he feels. See, we live we living in times now where feelings should take over the facts. So what Andrew Tate did, he bring facts over feelings. 
People don't like that. People want their feelings catered to. They don't want the real. People don't want real no more. No. People want their feelings catered to. And when you give somebody the real, backed up with facts, and you show people that you put in the work, people hate that. They don't like that. People are always trying to look for holes in your game. They're always trying to look for flaws. And they couldn't find any flaws with Andrew Tate. You know, started with the kickboxing background. But he's been out here. Been out here. Had a short stint with MMA. But been out here. Works out. Tries to uplift men. Try to bring masculinity back. I've been making videos about how we just, men just like true masculinity in society now. Andrew Tate, he's trying to bring that back. And that's part of the reason why they want to silence him. Because he's trying to actually uplift men and, you know, get men to realize their value. Realize their value and realize you can go places out here. But yeah, that's how Andrew Tate took over the internet in one year. He real raw with it, big social media influencer. First one to stand on everything that he says, has the money, has the women, everything that men really you know, want it. And he says the things that men really want to say. It's billionaires that look up to Andrew Tate because they have the money, but they can't say the things that they want to say or they don't have the control over their women like they would like, even with their money. You got billionaires that look up to this man. So that's how big Andrew Tate was in 2022. But yeah, how Andrew Tate took over the internet in one year. Let me know what y'all think. I like Andrew Tate, because he's always trying to help, man, and he stands on everything that he says. He's raw with it, and he's facts over feelings. And that's how we got to be out here, facts over feelings. Because our feelings not going to get us anywhere. Make you feel good just for a few hours or a few days, but your feelings, nah. Facts over feelings, because... When you go by facts, you really make improvements in your life and you don't sugarcoat shit. You make the adjustments and you do what you gotta do. So, yeah, I agitate, took over the internet in one year. Let me know what y'all think, drop something down in the comments. You know, I can't stop. Like I said, move your body is winter, but you gotta still get out here and move, so. Let me know what y'all think, I can't stop. Like another one, pop, pop, pop. Let's get it.